you talk about their pace, especially in the first 20, 25 minutes. I mean, it was back and forth, but they've got some speedy folks. Yeah, they do. Um, they play. They play pretty good in the back from the back. Um, we tried to to come up to to steal the ball. We did it a couple of times. Um, maybe we should have hurt them more when we did it. Um, but second half, I think we we pushed even harder, and they got tired. And, and um, unfortunately, we couldn't score. But, but uh, like I said, it was a good game overall. You've talked about in the past using your vision and, and your veteran leadership in the back, seeing these plays. Is that what you need to do with the speedy guys uh, that they put out there? Yeah, of course. I mean, communication is is key, um, especially when you play against fast players. Uh, technical players you need to have communication because one against one is is difficult so you need to make sure that you have cover or or that you give cover uh, when needed uh, so that's a very uh, important key, key for for a good game and then things totally change with Kenwin Jones coming in because he's now flicking on headers so the challenge comes changes before you uh, both you and Ofaro yeah uh, it did uh, that gave us other challenges but I mean, the game was um, to our favor, I think, uh, in second half. Um, if we scored, I think we'd have won with more than one goal. Um, but, I mean, that's that's the part of the game. And, and um, luckily, it comes now in the beginning of the season, because these kind of games, you have to win. Um, you have to score, because they will have a chance or two in the end of the game. And that's what happened. Uh, Luckily, they didn't score for those chances, but we have to score when we have the chances to, um, to to kill this kind of games. You talked about the importance of communication when you're trying to stop a team like like Atlanta. How do you do that? Do you do a crash course because you're starting with all these new guys in the back? Uh, I mean, how do you speed up? The I don't know. It's 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 just the language of soccer, I guess. Uh, even now, it's, it's easier for me now because now it's English. Uh, I mean, I've, I've played in China and, and Turkey and Ukraine. That's three different kind of languages, um, but it's it's a universal language. Uh, soccer, you, you you just have to know how to play soccer, then you know how to to communicate. Um, but, but not even the language part. Just just playing with guys that you're not used to playing with back there. I mean, you and Chad have a very good rapport. You know what each other's going to do. Yeah. Where you don't know as much with these guys. No, so how do, how yeah. Do you, uh, do you yeah. But that? I mean, I I know where I want my teammates to be, and that's what I'm trying to do. Um, trying to put them in the position so we can win the ball or we can play out of the back or whatever. Um, so that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to help myself, and I'm trying to help the team at the same time. Um, by com communicating. Right, right at the end of the first half, you, you made a couple of really nice plays to clear the ball, including the one where, where you, you had to deke past two guys inside your own box. I, I mean, are, are you consciously thinking to yourself, like, like man, I, I've got to, I, I'm in a little bit of trouble here? Or, or what, how do you how do you stay, how do you keep your, your concentration during, during something like that? I mean, sometimes, yeah, of course, you, you have a red flag, like, yeah, this is going to be a dangerous one. So, uh, then you have to take even like try to go deeper, try to kill the momentum, or you have to try to win the ball. I mean that's that's sometimes a tough decision, and, and but you just have to go with what you what you believe in and do it 100%. And sometimes you get lucky. Why this game in scoreless? Was it uh, just the final pass on each team? Um, it's difficult to say. I mean, um, if we have the answer to that, I mean we. Would have scored six goals every game. I think um, <clears throat> maybe we give the ball a little bit too early, the last pass, um, the right pass, but maybe not the right timing. Um, maybe that. Maybe. I mean, they're doing a good job as well defending. So it's it's not just playing against junior players. It's it's a good team we're playing against. So they're doing a good job and. <laughs> Sometimes um, you make easy goals, sometimes you have to work a lot more for, for scoring.